The beloved cafe at Allerton Park and Retreat Center reopened to the public this spring. And now it's under new management. And storyteller Aaron Valley joins us with more. Hello. Were there Hello. wieners on the menu? Yes. <laughs> there actually was one wiener on Somehow the menu. Somehow we've come full circle. Uh, um, yes, but sandwiches made with local bread, salads with herbs Ooh. from the garden, and my favorite part, delicious iced tea. All things you can enjoy at the Greenhouse Cafe. And you might recognize the new woman in charge because she's been featured on CI Living a few times. Check it out. Every morning I walk in and I have beautiful flowers and shrubbery. And, you know, who can say that right outside their office door they have chocolate mint growing? You know, so it's just beautiful to come in. It's easy to work up an appetite strolling through the beautiful gardens of Allerton Park and Retreat Center. Now, the park's favorite eatery is under new management. You might already be familiar with Leah Bodine, owner and operator of Champagne's Blue Dragonfly Catering. As of May 1st, she's extended her business to include Allerton's Greenhouse Cafe here in Monticello. The cafe serves park visitors, including yogis, church groups, and book clubs. Need a rainy day pick-me-up? The Greenhouse Cafe's got you covered. Even though it may be raining or the weather may not be cooperating, we have a beautiful little dining area with local art, and we're air-conditioned, and <laughs> you can just come out and have a nice lunch. Um, Bodine is bringing 30 years of restaurant industry experience with her. When creating the cafe menu, she wanted to play off the different sculptures and sites around Allerton. You can have a sun singer salad or a food dog. Enjoy delicious ricotta toast on local bread. Simple chicken salad and homemade baked goods. I think customer service uh, is key and I also think that our food is fabulous. Val Verde, manager of the Greenhouse Cafe, says part of the eatery's experience is simply being surrounded by all the park has to offer. Well, when you come in, you feel awesome because it's such a beautiful place. And then if you've had a rough day on your way out, it's almost like an easing back into the world. Some things grown right outside the cafe's doors end up in these recipes. The popular Allerton tea uses fresh mint grown in Allerton's herb garden. For Bodine, it's a treat to serve the park's visitors via the cafe and special events. And she hopes others will swing by for a sandwich and a stroll. You know, we really get people from all over. Um, we're a destination, uh, more so than something for the community, which I kind of would like to see more of the community come in. So I'm hoping that they, you know, come out and visit us, especially on Quiche Sunday. I love Quiche Sunday. And I got to say, those quiches are good. I got to try one. <laughs> well, here's a look at the Greenhouse Cafe's hours. They're open Tuesday through Sunday. Not open on Mondays, though. We'll connect you to the cafe's Facebook page online at CILiving.tv. I think Quiche Sunday should totally be a thing. It can be. You just got to make them at home. But they're not, they're not as good as hers. Well, that's uh, the problem with oh Quiche Sunday. Yeah. You have yeah. to make the quiche. <laughs> you know what they say.